Jamie Carpenter Jackson. We'll pretend that she's from Florida. Hey, Jamie from Florida. Sunny Florida. Okay. How do you clamp your pieces to make sure they are flush or square with when screwing them together with mm. pocket holes? Good question. Great question. Great question. So we have a couple of ways we do this, if we're being honest. Well, I would first say the Craig right angle clamp is pretty awesome for certain things. There's some cases where it doesn't work. The right angle clamp is good <clears> if you're <throat> going to do a leg to like an apron piece or yeah, something. Yeah, because the little metal thing fits up into the pocket hole. And then it's got a face clamp on the other side. And it grabs it. If that's not an option, occasionally, like today, we were building something where the two buys didn't quite line up. So we took a big Irwin clamp and we clamped that piece to something else and we sucked it in kind of and that way we could still access the pocket holes to get it in there. Another thing that I like to use is the Craig face clamp and I like to do that when I'm planking like a tabletop because you can clamp at the joint where each pocket hole is and it'll make it nice and smooth while you put that in that pocket hole in there. Last but not least would be the shanty clamp and we're always safe about this, but sometimes you just got to use your feet. You got to use a little elbow grease and push it in with your foot, maybe hold it with one foot, screw it with your arm. It just, it totally works. Guys. Shoes are great because you can bend your foot and you've got the rubber soles and you can hold something in place while you screw That's, it. And that goes into time management right there too. Yeah. <laughs> That's how we get it done so quick. 